Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Wizards versus 76ers NBA matchup on Wednesday, December 6, 2023. Of course, we do tons of free picks every day, but the games we like the best, well, those are the ones we put in the premium picks area. So click on the premium picks tab and use the discount code PICK to get 15% off. We also have Dime Club and Sharp Trading Plays meant for people who make big bets. If that's you, text the number you see on the screen. Not available on the website. I make big bets. I know a lot of you do too, so text that number. But let's get to this one. Wizards taking on the Sixers. The Wiz, nine-point dogs in this game out of the gate. Total set at 238 is the Wiz. 3-16 Three and sixteen on the season, and one and six straight up at home. We Morris one and six against the number at home. They are just a bad team that doesn't cover point spreads. That is called the double whammy. But the thing is, on the road, they've been fairly effective covering the spread. It's really at home where they have taken it on the chin once again, where we see them here. Meanwhile, the Sixers twelve and seven on the season. To be honest, as as nice as that record sounds, I believe they're a better team than that. And uh, five and four straight up on the road. 13 and 6 overall against the number and 6 and 3 against the number on the road. But in their last 10 games, just 4 and 6 straight up. And I think that's where we've seen the Sixers kind of falter just a little bit. And, you know, those games, losing back to back games, heading into this little mini break, losing to the Pelicans and to the Celtics, they were getting 11 and a half points against the Celtics. No, no Joel Embiid in that game. And I think that's the big deal there for them. Of course, jo- have Joel Embiid. They are a different team. And I think without James Harden, I really like the way the Sixers have looked through the bulk of the season. They did lose that game at Minnesota. They lost the game at home against Cleveland. So a little bit of inconsistency in recent times. So maybe the break probably helped this team pretty good, you know. Um, you know, I think on the, on the other side of it, you know, when we look at the uh, Washington Wizards, This is just a team that has struggled all season long, and, you know, they're going to continue to struggle as one of the worst teams in the NBA. They just, you know, don't have the depth or the talent to compete against the top-level teams. Offensively, the Sixers shooting just a half a percentage point above the league average, but they're up here against the worst defense in the NBA. Teams shoot over 50% against the Wizards, and from beyond the arc, teams shoot 37%, well above the league average of 36.3. The Sixers shooting 37.7%. From beyond the arc and of course that's after getting rid of James Harden the thing about the Sixers too is they bury those free throws over 85 percent from the line so far this season they also go to the line um, a good amount of the time so it's like when you go to the line a good amount of time and you make a good amount of those shots well it's certainly going to help you when we look at um, you know the the Sixers defense certainly these guys can D it up and beat is intimidating and as we see with bad teams in general Generally, their offense is actually pretty good, but it's like, you know, the games are won on the defensive side, and especially guarding the perimeter, and the Sixers, once again, do that extremely well. I just think the Sixers are a way better team here. I think they take it out on on the whiz. I'm going to take the Sixers, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. They're 100% free, and they'll tell you how often historically all the bets on the board hit, putting on the best odds and the best bets today.